Hegelian dialectics of master and slave in the phenomenology of spirit. In his seminal work, The Phenomenology of Spirit, the German philosopher George Wilhelm Hegel explored the intricate dynamics of human consciousness and the evolution of self-awareness. One of the pivotal moments in this philosophical journey is the dialectical relationship between master and slave, an exploration that unfolds within the broader context of Hegel's dialectical method. This essay will delve into Hegel's dialectics, particularly focusing on the concept of master and slave, and eludicate uh, how it encapsulates the genesis of human consciousness and self-realization through the spirit of labor. Dialectics in the Phenomenology of Spirit Hegel's dialectical method serves as a cornerstone in understanding the development of human consciousness. The dialectical process involves the clash and synthesis of opposite forces, leading to emerge of a higher and more complex form. In the phenomenology of spirit, the dialectical journey unfolds through various stages, culminating in the famous section on master and slave. Master and slave dialectics. The master and slave dialectics encapsulates the fundamental struggle for recognition, autonomy, and self consciousness. Hegel introduced the concept as a confrontation between two individuals, the master and the slave, each seeking a recognition from the other. The master asserts dominance through force, yet it is the slave who ultimately gets a unique form of self conscience through labor. Labor as the crucible of self-consciousness. According to Hegel, it is through labor that slave transcendence mere biological existence and attains a higher form of self-consciousness. The act of labor is transformative as it requires skill, creativity and purpose. In the process of transforming nature, the slave recognizes their own agency and contribution, thus realizing their individuality. Furthermore, the master, reliant on the labor of the slave, becomes dependent on the products of labor for its sustenance. In this interdependence, a dialectical shift occurs. The slave, by contributing to the material world, gains a sense of self-worth and recognition. The master, in turn, becomes reliant on the labor of the slave for their own sustenance and social outstanding. Mutual recognition and freedom, the accumulation of the master and slave dialectic, is the attained of mutual recognition. Both the master and the slave recognize the integral role they play in each other's existence. This mutual recognition, according to Hegel, is a crucial step toward genuine freedom. The dialectical process leads to synthesis, where the antagonistic relationship transforms into a more harmonious and reciprocal one. Hegel's exploration of the master and slave dialectics in the phenomenology of spirit provides profound insight into the genesis of human consciousness and self-realization. The spirit of labor emerged as the crucial tool which individuals transcendent their initial states of existence and attain a higher form of self-consciousness. The dialectical journey characterized by conflict and synthesis culminates in the mutual recognition of both master and slave, paving the way for genuine freedom. In this dialectic unfolding, the birth of human consciousness is intricately linked to the spirit of labor, exemplifying the profound interconnectedness of self-awareness, recognition and the transformative power of human labor.